Grab a jacket before you head out. It is 43 degrees in Des Moines, lighter winds than yesterday morning, but uh, boy, is it, it cold out there, especially uh, for early October. 41 in Ames, 43 in uh, Carroll, down in Creston, Osceola, and Ottumwa. We're in the upper 30s right now, also at 39 in Grinnell. So where we're at in the 40s is where we have some low-lying cloud cover. That's the case across much of northern and parts of central Iowa. Down south, it's mostly clear, so the clear skies are allowing for some cooler conditions at this moment. High pressure in place across the Midwest today. That's going to keep things dry until late tonight. At that point, we'll see some moisture streaming in ahead of a cold front. So pretty rainy conditions expected from midnight tonight until about noon on Saturday. Here's a closer look at what we can expect. Bit of a cloudy start up north. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds in Des Moines throughout the day today. Increasing cloud cover this evening, but likely staying dry until after midnight. At that point, we'll see some fairly widespread showers and storms, probably initially in western and northwest Iowa, but then spreading across central Iowa by sunrise tomorrow morning. Morning. Some thunderstorms could be mixed in with that rain. This could be pretty heavy rain at times and then gradually shifting to the east once we get to Saturday afternoon. As you can see, the clouds are even going to clear out, so I'm expecting some sunshine by mid to late Saturday afternoon. Should be pretty comfortable at that point. But tomorrow morning is going to be a bit of a washout, and some of us could pick up over one inch of rain from Des Moines up to Fort Dodge, maybe even Mason City. Just depends on where those heaviest uh, showers and storms move through over the weekend. So a wet start to the weekend. We climb to 68 tomorrow afternoon, dry on Sunday with a high of 64. We'll be dry from Sunday all the way through next Wednesday, so a really nice fall-like stretch there with highs staying put in the 60s through Tuesday. A brief warm-up into the 70s on Wednesday and then really cooling down by this time next week with highs back down to the low 50s, Sabrina.